If you like and admire Marine Vacht's work, you should surely watch our selections for her best movies. Et si c'était toi qui étais obsédé par lui, jaloux. Number five, Young and Beautiful, directed by Francois Ozon, is a 2013 French coming-of-age drama that revolves around themes of identity, sexuality, and emotional exploration. The film stars Marine Vacht as Isabelle, a 17-year-old girl from a wealthy Parisian family who embarks on a journey of self-discovery through sexual encounters with older men. The film is divided into four parts, each representing a season in Isabelle's life as she transitions from adolescence to adulthood. It begins in summer, where Isabelle experiences her first sexual encounter while on vacation. Dissatisfied and seemingly unaffected by it, she returns to Paris where she begins secretly working as a high-end escort. <laughs> Number 4, Pinocchio 2019, is a fantasy film directed by Matteo Garone, based on the 1883 novel The Adventures of Pinocchio by Carlo Collodi. The film tells the classic story of Pinocchio, a wooden puppet carved by the poor woodcarver Geppetto, who dreams of becoming a real boy. Geppetto creates Pinocchio out of a desire for companionship and love. However, Pinocchio quickly gets into trouble due to his mischievous nature, making unwise decisions that lead him into dangerous situations. Throughout his journey, Pinocchio encounters a range of bizarre and fantastical characters. E io ti perdono tutti i guai che hai combinato. Number 3, Double Lover, is a 2017 French psychological thriller directed by Francois Ozon, based on the novel Lives of the Twins by Joyce Carol Oates. The film blends elements of mystery, eroticism, and psychological drama, creating a gripping narrative full of twists and surprises. Known for its provocative style and complex characters, it's an exploration of duality, identity, and obsession. We follow Chloe, a former model suffering from unexplained stomach pains, who begins therapy with a psychiatrist named Paul, they quickly fall in love and move in together. However, Chloe soon begins to suspect that Paul is hiding something from her. She discovers that he has a twin brother, Louis, also a psychiatrist, but with a much darker and more manipulative personality. Mentir pour séduire. C'est une pratique courante chez les jolies femmes. Number 2, What the Day Owes the Night 2012, is a French-Algerian historical drama film directed by Alexandre Arcadi. The film is based on the 2008 novel of the same name by Algerian author Yasmina Kadra, set in Algeria during the mid-20th century. It covers themes of love, cultural identity, and the tensions brought on by the French colonization and the Algerian War of Independence. We follow Yunus, a young Algerian boy, whose life takes a dramatic turn after his family falls into poverty, and his father gives him up to his wealthy uncle, renamed Jonas. He grows up in Oran, a cosmopolitan city in French Algeria. Surrounded by French settlers, Jonas integrates into the French culture, forging close friendships with other European boys and falling deeply in love with a girl named Emily. Adieu, Jonas. Attends. Et pour Emily? Non. S'il te plaît, j'ai donné ma parole. Number 1, The Confession 2016, is a French romantic drama directed by Nicolas Boucrif. The film is an adaptation of the 1961 novel Léon Morin, set during World War II in Nazi-occupied France. The Confession explores themes of faith, love, and moral conflict through the relationship between a young widow and a Catholic priest. The film is set in a small village in France during the German occupation. Barney, played by Marine Vacth, is a young, headstrong widow who is raising her child alone. As a devout communist and atheist, she resents the Catholic Church and its influence over the people. Frustrated by her circumstances and curious about religion, Barney decides to provoke the local priest by going to confession, despite her lack of faith. Do you agree with our list? Please let us know in the comments. And for more top movie videos, be sure to subscribe to Movie Soul.